what's up guys welcome to the channel my name is dj odyssey and on today's video i'm gonna show you how to make deep house if you're new to the channel please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to the channel of course and uh, so we're just gonna get straight into it and then get our ideas working you know so number one we're gonna start with the drums and hopefully we're gonna start with a kick yeah? so first thing find a nice kick so i'm gonna go inside my deep house essential simple pack one and then i'm gonna find a kick then you can drag it into here and say instrument track and then now you can put it here on C5. We can do this. If you want to, you can even make it higher like that. And then maybe reduce it there, you know. All right, we have a kick. It plays like that, it's very simple. And then maybe you need a rim shot next. So you can also drag it here and then instrument track and then we want to place it in between like that, All right? And then if that would click here, you can just do this. All right, we have a very simple thing. And then from here, what I would like to do is add like a some hi-hats, but I'm gonna add like an instrument track here. And then we're gonna use the FPC for some hi-hats. Uh, can come here and say empty, and then get into my packs as well, and we're gonna find some nice hi-hats. So you can drag this. So since I know I like to use maybe three or four hi hats, you know, I can just select like this. I think this is a cool. And you can pen the others straight from the FPC. And then you can just pen this one and then pen this one. It's a bit loud. You can even reduce it or you can use velocities to reduce it on there. And let's say we have these four. You want to rename this as uh, a hat. I'll just come here and say hat. So cool. We have some high hats. And then now you see where it's highlighted on the left is where your high hats are. And then you can now place it now. What I like about using this as well is that you can humanize it easier. You can come here and say humanize and then, okay, before we do that, I'm gonna play this. While I'm playing this way, I'm gonna humanize it. I think it's not bad. Just have to cut off the last part here. That's it. And it's a one bar thing. And it sounds like this. All right, cool. Now I wanna add some shakers, whatever. You can also use the FPC for these things. And then so for now, I'm gonna go and look for some shakers using uh, my shaker loops. Go to loops, uh, shaker loops, percussions. Drag it here and now you can say uh, audio track. And then fit to tempo, it's 110, it's fine, like that. And now you're good like that. Good thing about using this part is that now you can, it's already on your mixer. And you can rename these however you want. So now, go say instrument, track mode, instrument, and then let's say lounge lizard, because we're going for that soulful thing. And then, So 
So if something like that, uh, you can hear the, the sound like nice soulful cuts. Actually, let's do this. And it's how they look, very simple, not complicated. And then we can drag this to the next one. And then now, let's see what we can do now with this. So now we have some nice chords going on. So now let's find like some FX, uh, like a riser. And this is fine. Just audio track there. And then I can maybe force it to be just four bars. So we just do the time and it here. Then reduce it very low. So dope. And now we need like a down shift or down lifter. Or your track and then it sits right there and then you can reduce it low as well. So now that we have something like this, right? Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna keep it as like four, eight, like this eight bar thing. So you wanna remove this part, remove these. Just gonna drop it like this, right? So it's gonna depend on uh, the, the arrangement a little bit. So let's do this. Um, I can remove this and this can come maybe here. We can say this is like the climax part of the song. We will have to figure out what comes in and what doesn't come here, you know? So, so we're just keeping it as simple as we can, you know, like the basics into making this deep house thing, you know? I think now we need some pads, right? So let's say instrument mode and then I'm gonna look for some pads. I don't know which one. Let's say Nexus. I'm not sure. I don't know if single layer pads would be nice or not. Something ambient is fine. Great. Just put it like this. And then from here, we're kind of looking for something that I feel like maybe we need a baseline. So I'm gonna try put in instrument and then let's go to, let's add MIDI, mini, mini D. And then like we find like a nice bass. For now, I'm, I'm a fan of this mini thump.
okay, let's see if I'm going to be able to put in maybe some some kind of a saxophone or something, but something that's going to just give it like a soulful feel more, you know. Uh, let's try this. So I'm going to add in contact. We're just looking for a nice soulful feel, you know. So let's see what we have. So I'm going to try the alto sex. So now I'm looking for maybe a plug that will go in from here. And then I think that would be like a very nice track. We're not doing too much. We're just showing the basics of doing this type of music. So let's get a plug. Can even use Nexus again. Let's get some plugs. I probably want to use UK packs. I think that's it. Uh, it looks like this. And some way, somehow, maybe you want to add maybe some vocals. I'm going to try add vocals from Arcade. Try to see how it's going to sound. Is it now? Hey, I don't have this. So it has to be another uh, thing. I don't know what you guys think of this. Uh, for now, it's just a simple arrangement. You probably want to have maybe this coming in here. And these will be here. And this will definitely come back here. You probably want to put the vocals again here. 
Now you have something like this, I think. And I want to try play it from the beginning so that you guys can hear what I just made with, with you guys, with you guys, actually, with you guys. Yeah, so I think this is it. Uh, hopefully we'll do another tutorial like this one. It's been long. <laughs> so I'll see you guys on my next video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you like this type of content, man.